Well, hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. Today, I've got LA Colors Emerald, and I'm going to stamp on it. Today, I've started off with Peel Ease, and here is the LA Colors Emerald. This is from that metallic collection that I swatched on my channel. I topped it off with Pro FX Quick Dry Top Coat, and I will be using this plate right here that I got from AliExpress. It's BC10. It's kind of a lacy kind of thing. Bundle Monster Monocle Stamper and Beauty Big Bang Scraper. And I'll be using this Born Pretty White stamping polish. I've cut a little bit of masking tape into just some little squares and I'm taping off some areas on my nails. So I'm gonna just stamp on parts of them today. Kinda just doing something a little different. Just want to make sure it's all mushed down really good and got a good seal on it. I'm using the back of my cleanup brush to kind of rub them down just to make sure they're on there. I was looking for my painter's tape, couldn't find it, so I just went ahead and used this masking tape. So there we go, we got them all ready. And now for some stamping. I had been wanting to do this for a while and I just finally just broke down and did it. And I'm turning the stamp sideways instead of normal to make sure I get coverage from side to side. And then as soon as I'm done, I'm peeling that tape up very carefully and using the excess to kind of do some cleanup, you know. Let that tape be multi-purpose. Go ahead and get all the use I can out of it. And here we go. We're going to do that again. I am cleaning that plate off in between with just some acetone and a cotton ball, just so you know. Go. And this one I ended up with like an empty space on the side and at first I'm thinking oh it'll be okay it's alright not that noticeable but you'll see later I can't take it and I end up doing something with it. Once again I'm using that little piece of tape to do some cleanup as I go along. You guys know cleaning up white stamping polish is my least favorite. <laughs> Here we go. And I did do the same design on all my nails. As you can see, my thumb was done already. I've just been picturing it, and it's so funny. You picture manicures and in your head, and you know, this is one that I've been picturing for a while. So I was really glad to find the time to do it. A little bit more cleanup. I know y'all think Woody's out of a job, but trust me, he's not. Here we go with the pinky. And I really do like these little plates that I got from AliExpress. Um, the BC plates, you know, oh, oh, I almost tried to stamp with the cap on. Any of y'all ever done that? <laughs> that? That doesn't work so good. Same deal, pull the tape off immediately and do a little bit of cleanup with it, you know, just to keep things tidy and neat, best we can. So there we go. I'm looking at it. I'm like, nope, that ain't gonna work. So I'm taking another piece of tape and I'm pulling up as much of it as I could. If I had done it immediately after I stamped it, I might would have had better success. I have had this work and pull up all of the image. But this go around, I think it was just too dry. So I am going to fuss with it and fight with it and try to make it work. But I'm going to end up having to take some nail polish remover to it. Okay, I think she finally realizes, give it up, girl. So there's my little dampened dish with some nail polish remover in it. And I'm taking the corner of a cotton round and I'm just wiping it off. And I don't do just a fantastic job of it. I kind of leave like a white haze over it, but I'm over it. So I re my tape on, and we're going to try to stamp this one again. One more time. There we go. Perfect. No lines, no open gaps. Love it. Very happy about that. So there we go. And I'm going to go in and do some cleanup with my Sonia Kushak's Tools number 27 brush. Um, I promise, I promise that that brush, cleanup brush testing fiasco video will be coming up. I promise. Um, 
but you know, I still got a Sonia Kishak's tools brush, so I'm, it's, it's my go-to. But I do have a ton of brushes to sample and try out. I bought a bunch of brushes off of eBay. I bought some e.l.f. brushes, stuff that Target had, so we'll get around to doing that someday. I just like to find something that's easy to find and grab and not break the bank. So there we go. I'm going to top this off with that Bundle Monster Smudge Free Top Coat. This stuff is really good um, if you're really struggling with that. Um, I think other companies might make something like this also, but this is the one I have. And I'm, see, there's Woody. I told you he wasn't out of a job. But I really do like that top coat. But I am going to top this with some posh top coat and put one of these like little blue pearl looking. Uh, you know, decorations on it right there at the points. Kind of, you know, tie it in together a little bit. And I'm using that little wax pencil that I demoed not too long ago. Figured I have it, might as well use it, you know. Tap it down. And there we go. And you can top coat over these, but I didn't. There's my swatch photo. I want to thank you for watching, and until next time, be good to yourself. Talk to you soon. Bye.